hi and welcome to my channel look if you're somebody who is into teaching or you've been planning to get into teaching or move to the uk as a teacher this year 2023 has been the perfect time for you to do that so if you're watching this now and you've wanted to move to the uk this year or you're still planning to move and you you haven't been able to get a job look there is more good news coming for people that are teachers in the UK. The reason for this is that the government has announced that they want to recruit at least 6,500 teachers before the end of this year. This year only has about two months. So that is a plan that is just amazing for anybody who is interested in getting into teaching. So in today's video, I'm going to be telling you some of these incentives that the government has announced in order to attract more people to get into teaching. So if you're new to my channel, you're welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, I appreciate your time. And I hope that you're finding these videos helpful. But most importantly, you're implementing this information because I'm not here to just like waffle out and you're like, oh, just another YouTube video. I need you to give me your word that you're going to implement. So leave a comment in the comment section below. Are you a teacher? You know, are you a qualified teacher, unqualified? Have you got teaching experience? Are you looking to get into teaching in the UK? What is your situation? Have you applied for any jobs? What feedback have you had? Leave that in the comment section and say, Melvis, I will implement the things that you're talking about in today's video. Also, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, look, you don't want to be a stranger on here. Hit the subscribe button so you're the first person to be notified every single day when I drop a new video on here at 10 a.m. prompt UK time. Yes. I drop a new video on YouTube every single day so that you've got all the information that you need and all you need then is the implementation to put that information into practice and make sure that you're reaping all the benefits that come with, you know, those opportunities. So I also have a newsletter, which I've dropped a link in the comment section below. Um, I share information such as this, you know, directly to your inbox, so you never miss out on such vital information for your personal and professional development. I share information about free visa sponsorship opportunities to move to the UK or to switch your visa if you're already in this beautiful, amazing country. I also share information about career progression opportunities in the UK, work from home jobs so you can supplement your income, side hustle ideas so that you can, you know, do your job, progress in your career, but have a plan B where you're going to then develop and progress into your own side hustle so you can retire early because I'm on a mission to retire by the time I turn 40. So if I'm working beyond the age of 40, it should be a choice, not because I'm broke. And let me tell you, I'm very, very close to achieving that because I have multiple sources of income that make me a lot of money compared to say my nursing job, but it's taken years of effort, of hard work, of dedication and implementation. So what are we talking about? If you check that newsletter in the comment section, do join. You're also going to find my contacts on there. There's my WhatsApp number. There's my email address. If you need to reach out, then please do so. So we're talking about teaching jobs. So they're trying to recruit at least 6,500 extra teachers before the end of this year. Why has this occurred? Why the rush this time? The rush is because data has been released by the teaching union in the UK, which has said that 40,000 people have left teaching this year in the UK. Obviously, it is very staggering for the government. Many schools are closing because they haven't got teachers, which is such a shame because teaching is such a vital profession. And, you know, our kids, ourselves, we need that service. So, 40,000 teachers leaving, it's a staggering number. They've had strikes all year. It's really been a difficult year for teachers in the UK. But this always comes with more opportunities. And that's why the government has approved more visa sponsorship opportunities for overseas teachers. So what are some of these incentives? The first incentive really is the fact that you don't need to be a qualified teacher to get visa sponsorship to move to the UK or to switch your visa if you're already in this country. By the way, if you're watching this and you wonder who I am, I work as an advanced nurse practitioner for the NHS. So I work for the National Health Service here in England. So I live in the UK and I have a private career coaching program where I support nurses, carers, teachers, students, you know, student nurses, prospective student nurses. You're looking for free visa sponsorship opportunities to move to the UK or to switch your visa if you're already in this amazing country. Then if you check the description box below or the about section of this channel, you're going to see a link to join my private coaching program. When you do, you have access to information about nanny jobs, who is recruiting, how to apply, you know, visa sponsorship jobs. You've got carer jobs, you have teaching jobs. You, you literally have information about all 
the jobs and professions and careers that are currently offering visa sponsorship as well as career progression in each of those sectors so there's quite a lot involved in the coaching program it's about you what is the best opportunity for you how do you proceed how do you move to the next stage what about your cv what should it look like what about the interview making sure that you're the best candidate for that job so again you want to 100 percent check that out on the description box below or the about screen of this channel and do join the program so that we can get started with that implementation because what i do on youtube is give out the information that is needed but when it comes to implementation that is what the coaching program is for because i know that you may be watching this video you're feeling really pumped up now you're so motivated but once you get out of youtube and this video is gone you're going to go back to the normal things that you do and then you know, no results will be had. And you watch video after video after video, which look, yes, it's helpful for information purposes, but what will give you a job is not, it's not that you need to implement that. You need to sit down and see which school is recruiting. What's the best subject for me? How do you apply? How do I proceed? That is really what the program is about. So like I was saying, there are many incentives. These are also cash incentives as well as relocation bonuses. For example, teachers are currently getting a £10,000 relocation bonus if you get to the UK. You know, so again, these are opportunities that you want to pursue. Also QTS, so qualified teacher status. To work in the UK as a teacher, the government has indeed announced, and this is a fashion, this has been for a few years now, considering the shortage of teachers in the UK, the fact that you don't need qualified teacher status to work as a teacher in the UK. So even if you're overseas and you're looking for jobs, there's no need going through the, the you know, QTS process. It can be long, cumbersome and very expensive. And it doesn't guarantee that you're going to get a job anywhere. And that's why there are many people here that have QTS, but they still have no job. And it's like, oh, I thought I was going to get QTS and then get a job. Look, the two things are not connected. Getting a job is completely different from getting the requirements for the job. So again, you need to understand what the differences are with the schools, you know, what are the requirements, what you need to get a job is really what you should be focusing on. So another incentive which has been absolutely smashing and the best so far is opening apprenticeships to overseas candidates. Look, I'm somebody that I'm very passionate about apprenticeships because being in the UK, I have done two apprenticeships um, for master's programs. In fact, I've just finished one where I was doing a master's in advanced clinical practice for three years, funded by my employer. And I was paid, you know, a whole lot of money to actually do the apprenticeship. So I'm a huge advocate for the fact that you shouldn't be going to uni to do, to do the traditional degrees, but you should be going for the apprenticeships. So the government has made apprenticeships for teachers open to overseas candidates, which means if you want to become a teacher in the UK, if you've got no teaching experience whatsoever, you're like, oh, I'm going to become a teacher. You can't do that through an apprenticeship, which means they'll pay you to train you to become a teacher. Like, how amazing is that? You know, these are the sorts of opportunities if you're watching my video, you should definitely be going for. And please do me a favor to share this video with your loved ones, friends, colleagues, network, so they're aware of these amazing opportunities that this beautiful country has in order that we can all pursue them. Because let me tell you, if you're in the UK and you don't know the right things to do, it's going to be a struggle. You're going to be sat there saying to yourself, was this country worth it? But if you're able to get the information, implement, go for the best opportunities, you know, the creme de la creme, so that you're not just like scraping, you are actually going for the top opportunities because that's the whole point we're here. You know, I always say to myself, when I was moving to the UK, my plan was to become an advanced nurse practitioner, which is the most senior clinical nursing position. And 10 years down the line, that's the job that I do because you can't come this far to accept mediocrity. You cannot come this far to just scrape the surfaces and live like, you know what I mean, with all due respect for all the different jobs. But I don't think that the sacrifices that we make to get to this country, they are just too much that you need to be thinking big. You need to think smart. You need to be able to, to dream big, you know, to go for the best opportunities, to push yourself so that you are at the top. Because if you're not... Look, bills, rent, everything. It doesn't look at you and say, oh, you're a poor immigrant. You're not earning enough. Nobody cares. You're going to have bills, rents, council tax like anyone else. So if you're watching my videos, you better be part of the top 1%, top 1% of people that are going to push themselves 
to any extent that is needed in order to succeed, to excel, you know, to thrive, to become the best version of yourself, earn a lot more money and retire early. Nobody watching my videos should be retiring at the age of 70, like worst of all 80. We should be retiring young when we're still full of life with our families, you know, sipping wine somewhere like, you know, that those are the dreams that I have. And I'm very open to sharing those dreams here with you. And what I'm doing, because it's well good and fine to have a dream, but you need to put in the effort to get that dream to a reality. So if you're a teacher, you know, anybody who is a teacher, get them to be encouraged to go for these opportunities. 6,500 jobs, teachers, before the end of 2023 is an amazing opportunity you should not be missing. So like I've said, if you need any personalized guidance, consider joining my private coaching program, which I've dropped a link in the description box below or the about section of this channel. But the whole point I'm saying this is do put yourself forward and I'll see you in this other video. Thank you for your time. I'll see you in this video.